Hey folks, this is Vagrant. Welcome back to my time at Sandrock. In the last video, we finally kind of got started, I suppose, and found out what we're going to be doing, and that is we're going to be making a lift for the uh, <laughs> bacon babies. Ah, uh, kill me. Um, oh yeah, uh, so I need more fuel for my cycler. Hmm. Mm. I'm still trying to figure out how the game works, <laughs> quite clearly. I'm going to put four pieces of wood in. There we go. And I'm going to put all my scrap in. Oh, I can't. Okay. Okay. Oh, I'll, I'll get there. Anyway, so yeah, we're building a lift with our new Pagan Baby Workshop for the minor people who live in town. Oh, they wanted me to build a weapon, didn't I? Didn't I? <laughs> I think that's a good idea. Let's see if we can, what we can build. Oh, that's updating there. Okay, we're way away from that, clearly. Uh, do, do, do. So these are all the th things we can make at the moment. We can make stone trough, a thin thread, wooden stick, stone axe, pick hammer, stone daggers, grinding saws, animal skin, da, 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 bronze stuff. That might be pretty cool. Stone sword. So these are the kind of things that are definitely on my list. But I need, like, bronze or something? Which I can't seem to make. All right, I can't make the, the ingot at the end there. So that suggests we need another... Unless we get it from this. I suppose. No, we don't. There must be something else we can make at some point. Aha! A furnace! I bet this is what we need, right? So I'm gonna put this in my... my thing there. So we go to bed. Let's go to bed. I'll make a furnace, that'll let me make ingots. Seems important. But we'll, uh, we'll... God, my house is so boring. Wait, 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 I've gotta think. Let me put my thing up. Uh... It's taken me a long time to figure out how to play this game. I just can't play the game. Can I put this on the wall? Yeah, nice. Beautiful. Build a licensed pagan babies. <laughs> Wait, can I move it up higher? How do I just do that? No idea. I think it should be above the bed, maybe. About that. There we go. Bedtime. I can paint. <gasps> okay. This cost me. I don't think so. Oh, it does. Okay. One day. <laughs> I don't know if I'm going crazy. The UI just feels. I ju I just need some time with it. I'm sure that's all it is. It's a beautiful new day. Let's get to what was this? Home assessment board. Okay. Oh, you can make your home sexy, basically. <clears throat> Come on, you cheeky little blighter. One sec. I need to grab a thing. It's a small human outside my door. Child labor laws. <laughs> I was delivering your sample newspaper. Why is the child working for the new Are you a child? I'm pretty sure it's a child. One sec. There we go. If you like reading it, just go to the newsstand near City Hall to subscribe. Then you will get each issue in the mail. Oh, hey. I bet it's hard moving to a new place. I know this town like the back of my hand. Let me show you around. I'm a super good tour guide. I know lots of stuff about Sandrock. All right then. Yeah, cool. The Jasmine Co. official Sandrock tour is now beginning. Our first stop will be the Wandering Y Yakmel Ranch. Oh, little speed demon. I'm trying to play one-handed here. Oh, this is very difficult to do one-handed. <laughs> <laughs> This girl can't half shift. Pass 
passengers, please look ahead and notice Mr. Cooper, Mrs. Mabel, and Elsie's house. They have a really big ranch. That means they get milk for everyone. Maybe some other stuff, too. Oh, you can see the Acmel over there. I like to say hi to them every day. Sometimes they even say hi back. But it sounds like... Moo! <laughs> Sell stuff that you can use to take care of animals here. That might be useful for you, huh? I want a Yakmel. On to the next stop. Please keep your hands and feet inside the imaginary vehicle. This kid's adorable. I'm sure there was a kid in Portia that I absolutely hated. <laughs> but Jasmine's kind of cute, I'm not gonna lie. Don't tell her I said that though. What do we. Oh, I don't know. Miss Martle was the first mayor of Sandrock, and she found this oasis a long time ago. We all drink this water, so don't step in it. In the middle, you can of course see a statue of Mr. Peach. One day I hope I can invent something really cool like Peach did. The big water tower over there is where we keep extra water. Mr. Burgess takes care of it. And you can get some from him if you give him some money. Oh, hey, that reminds me. Do you know what the official town slogan is? Minister Matilda came up with it, and now everybody says it all the time. Defeat the desert. Oh, that's really good. But it's not our slogan. Maybe it should be, though. My mom is working really hard to stop the sand from spreading into our town. This concludes the Martos Oasis part of our tour. For our next stop, we will be visiting Fabulous City Hall. <laughs> All right then. You have such little legs. How are you moving so fast? Do I got stick in my mouth? The first thing you will notice about City Hall is that it's very big. Grown-ups often go into this building and talk a lot. My ma works here when she isn't going out into the desert. Aunt Heidi also works next door. She builds bridges and upgrades houses and stuff. Say, isn't that the same job as you? What? Oh, by the way, from the station to here is the main street of Sandrock. Arvio store, Grandma Vivi's clothes shop, Mr. Owen's saloon, um, Mr. Popo's parlor. Yeah, they're all on this street, so you can definitely go shopping here when you have some time. Moving right along. Doo doo doo. Bearing copper stick, thick rope, wooden stick, bricks, crane lift. Oh, my beloved. I will return for you, Amira. <laughs> this town really opens up. I thought it, it seemed absolutely tiny to me. <clears throat> it felt quite a lot smaller than Portia, but it really grows. Give it a good old try. Need a camel. For the next stop on our tour, please bring your attention right over there, where you'll see the beautiful Church of the Light Temple. Most of us come here every Sunday to sing and listen to Minister Matilda tell us not to do bad stuff. My favorite songs are ones about Peach. You should come next time. Mm -hmm. And this is the last stop on the tour. If you follow the path on the right, you'll find the Research Center and the Golden Goose. Um, I think that's it. This place is pretty big. You should look around when you have some downtime. This concludes the very special Jasmine Co. tour. That's enough walking for today. <laughs> so, what do you think of your new home? Oh, he's so mean. Yeah, I think so too. A lot of people don't like this place so much. But you do, so I think that means we can be good friends. Anyway, I'm sure you have lots of things to build. As for me, I need to go to Aunt Katori's Game Center for business. Come join me if you get time. <clears throat> so I got 10 relationship points. I got some experience. It just seems worth it. Even if I didn't necessarily need it, right? Amira, no! My beloved. One day. I will return for you. That's why I shouldn't eat just before a video. <laughs> I'm trying to sort my face out. <laughs> oh, they sell the thing I need. What is it? I'm going to just check. Copper bar. Okay, I thought so. That's some pretty fancy looking. It's a, it's a freaking purple, that. 
Oh, hey, Jan. Oh, it's you again. All right, don't look so happy about it. Say, since I've got you, did I ever explain the uh, mission board to you? <laughs> Dedicated to figuring it out yourself, eh? Well, good on you. The less time I have to spend training you, the more time I'll have for, um, you know, uh, big important uh, president stuff. I think you'll find the information you need in the Commerce Guild handbook on my desk. Check it out if there's something you're not getting. Ciao! What's this? What's going on? Right. No, I'm getting distracted by things. I want to go. <clears throat> Remember, we have to go to... So this is the... Uh, explorey bits. I don't have a better name for it than the explorey bit at the moment. The salvage area. And we're building the lifts for these lads, but there's tons of stuff lying around apparently that we can hopefully utilize. Hello, Bamna. You know, we're all mad. No, Venti told me sorry the other day. It was crap. What? <laughs> What's going on? <laughs> Faye drew me, a, drew me a picture. It was crap. Crap, 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 crap. Okay. I wonder if they'll ever be voice acted. I have to assume so. All right, let's get to work. <clears throat> this is uh, a lot of junk. I wonder if my weapons can break. So, oh, a bit of gold. First time, very nice. Ah, crab, lobster, demon, data disc. Sort of research about that. Okay, it's cool because there's a lot of things I obviously recognize at least a little bit from um, my time at Porsche. Which I'm aware that I've pronounced <laughs> several different ways in this single video so far. Gonna go. Shadow of a woman. Bloody Nora. Yeah, that's kind of spooky. Lots of rubits. Come back here later on. Um, so I guess that's where you go for the salvaging and stuff like that. I don't think I can get anything else here. What's this? Oh! Okay, that's what the red means. I've got to learn these things, folks. A bit of yak thorn. Okay, well, I'm assuming that I just got what I needed, right? Not allowed dead wood. Not allowed hard rock. Not allowed wood. I'm not allowed hard. I'm not allowed anything I like. Ooh, sand link. You're new. <clears throat> we, in part, we just have to figure out what it is I'm allowed to chop down and what I'm not allowed to chop down. Anywho. So I said I want to make... Oh, hello. Okay, this is our... Sure. Oh, a letter from Ma. Lydia, I miss you. Oh, it's hard to believe only a few days have passed since you left for Sun Rock. Your father and I are already missing you so much. Even when you were small, you were always wandering away from us. Sometimes I would just let you walk and see how far you'd go. That sounds like a terrible idea. I always get nervous before you did. So I guess we should have seen this coming. So proud of you. Know you're going to do great things at your job. No one else jumped at the chance to take that contract because it would be tough, but you took it anyway. I know you'll be able to bring Talesis to... What is Talesis? <laughs> Please. I just wish you'd take care of yourself a bit better. Those quilts I folded for you are still sitting by the door. Do you want me to mail them to you? The desert gets really cold at night, I've heard. We're so happy you're independent now, but Sandrock can be dangerous. Please don't hesitate to ask us for help. Your father is doing well. He's converting... something. Your room into a garden for his bonsai trees. I think he doesn't want to admit it, but seeing your empty room made him kind of sad. He says he'll move the trees out and let you back in any time. I hope you're not offended. Anyway, we've sent you some money for quilts. <laughs> let us know when you're settled in. Remember to take care of yourself. Thanks, Mum. Okay, an important meeting at 6 p.m. Okay. Well, what's this? What's this new thing I just picked up? What are you? Jerky. That gives me some stamina. Uh, you know what, we'll keep that. I'm going to put that over there. Right. Do I make my inventory bigger? Do I have to pay? Huh. 
How many golds do I have? I've got 200. I, I'm already... I, what I need to make is a chest, really, so I can store some stuff. Uh, what have we done over here? Okay, well, copper scrap can give me what I need, so we need to obviously put those in. Okay, so all my copper is in the queue. And then we add... Some... I've got quite a lot of this, so I'm going to put this in as well. Okay. Is that good? <laughs> No, I've got, it's the time remaining is 10 and a half minutes, right? But I've got 8 minutes 14 in, so I need to add some more, yeah? Yeah, okay, so I need to make sure it hits. Right, that'll do. Cool, there, okay, so that, that should now go for the entire length. Okay, sweet. In the meantime, let's look at what we need for a, a furnace. So I need stone troughs, which I believe I can make. How many did I just, how many did I just make? <laughs> Two. Okay, well, that's exactly what I needed. Rather coincidentally. Any quartz? From the quarry or the ore refinery? <clears throat> Any wooden sticks, but I have wooden sticks already. So all I need is quartz. Hmm. Do I get quartz just from bashing rocks? Also, what's this? Let's bash some rocks and see if we get any quartz. Um, any quartz. We'll go from there. What's that? That uh, looks like quartz. All right, sweet. So we need four pieces of quartz, and then oh, one more should be enough. And then, and then, make ourselves a furnace. Sexy, sexy furnace. It's a weird game in a way because it's so inherently low key, right? I mean, look at what's going on here. How do I make this not low key? How do I hype up what's going on here? I can't. I just have to like just chat. You know, it's gonna be a very chill season. Uh, chill season. A chill series. Bloody Nora. Hello, buddy. Give me that goddamn quarters. Hey, there we go. That's what I needed. And I've got some worms. Hello. Bonk. Come here. <laughs> this is my yakmel. It's not my yakmel. One day it'll be my yakmel. What you guys got for me? Might as well, right? Oh. It's an emo yakmel. It's a wild alpha. All right, I'm just gonna take your feces. Don't mind me. <laughs> Nothing to see here, buddy. Nothing to see here. It's a casual woman casually taking your feces. Hello. Ah. Oh. Okay. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> I want to make a chest as well, so I can get rid of some stuff. Some burbs over there. Right. <clears throat> it's on its way. This should be good. There we go. Got myself a furnace. Am I going to have to reload the game every time I want to pick up an item? <laughs> I think it's happened again. What time is it? Oh, right, it's five o'clock. Okay, right, I'm going to save it. <laughs> I'm hoping this gets fixed, <laughs> or if it's just a, a temporary bug, I suppose. It's not like it's taking a billion years to, to do, but it's a little bit irritating. Just to be able to... I mean, you use your builder thing <laughs> so much that if I have to do this every single time, it will drive me a little bit insane, I'm sure. But it does work. There we go. Very cool. Take it over here for now. Don't need to really organize things quite yet. 
So I can make bricks and I can make... So I can make bricks at the moment using that stuff, or I can make copper bar. Cool. Let me tell you that. Okay, I wanna I wanna get rid of them though. How do I There we go. Right, you do your thing, buddy. Um Can I make a okay, so that's the big thing I next need to make, right? What's the awning for? Can't do that yet, anyway. Crane lift. Oh, okay. <laughs> it's a lot of stuff. I mean, this. I guess this is what I expected, but yeah. There you go. Bam. What a big boy. All right. Anyways, let's head into town. Go attend this meeting. Wait, where am I going for this meeting? Is it at the church or is it the town hall? I think it's the town hall. Let me just check. Oh yeah, in front of City Hall. Okay, so that's in... Ooh, 15 minutes. Run! Pump those crazy legs! <clears throat> I'm gonna be late! I'm going to be late for my first meeting! Nee. Nee. I'm here. Margaret. Matilda, whatever the hell your name is. Simmer down now, y'all. <clears throat> As many of y'all know, our resident builder, Mason, who has been a hard-working member of our community for many years, will be leaving our flock to seek, shall we say, greener pastures. But today's meeting is not about goodbyes. There'll be plenty of time for that at Mason's retirement party. Though today is a celebration of hellos. Let's give it up for our new builders. Thanks, everyone. Very excited to be starting here. I'm going to do my very best to bring Telesis to Sandrock. <laughs> what is Telesis? Care to say a few words? <laughs> well, I didn't expect that one. We've got ourselves a companionable soul here. I'm sure you'll find lots of friends here in Sandrock. It would be nice to be able to type whatever I wanted. Praise Everyone, off. Everyone, let's be patient with our new builders while they learn the ropes. And builders, don't hesitate to ask any of us for help. We won't be hesitating in putting you all to work. One more time, a big Sandrock welcome for our new builders! We have some omelets, courtesy of none other than our very own Owen. Get them while they're still hot. Meeting adjourned. Oh, and remember, conserve water. Conserve water. It's a cult, I'm telling you, it's a bloody cult. <laughs> Nobody's gonna wanna hang out with me when I'm doing this. I look like a weirdo. Alright, my inventory is basically full at this point. I guess this is the same kind of deal, right? <clears throat> Health points, yeah. Put that at the end. Do I have any- oh, I've got three discs. Do we use those to buy new um, recipes, basically? <laughs> A clay bottle meant to contain things. Its usage is only limited by your imagination. And its size. Mainly its size. Annoyingly, things that are in this bar over here still take up room in my bottom inventory as well. Hello. Ah, you're a new builder. Nice to meet you. I'm Katori. I think we'll be working together a lot in the future. I hope so. I'm trying to turn Sandrock back into the jewel of the desert with my Golden Goose Entertainment Extravaganza Complex. Eh, that's a mouthful. It needs better phrasing. Anyway, even if you have no idea what I'm talking about, drop by and have some fun. Here, a few tokens to get you started. Oh, my inventory is full. Katori, no! Wait, is there anything I can get rid of? What do I hate? Oh, it's not full, though. I've got all that room in my taskbar. Oh my god, I've gone the slowest way. Wait, I wanted to check this, actually. Does that make a difference? Okay, 
that's worse. Backer's t-shirt. Oh, did I get that for... It says KS backer. But I I am a KS backer, as in a Kickstarter backer. I'm not, though. <laughs> but I did buy it in early access, so I guess that's why. Um, What do I not care about? I don't really care about the t-shirt, actually, but I want to sell it. Um... <clears throat> The feces. Goodbye, feces. I hot no. Where's my gift? Oh, I don't get my tickets now. <laughs> That's so sad. See ya. Wait, did, she, did I actually not get the tickets because of that? Oh, oh, there they are. Sweet, I got my tokens. Okay, now 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 we need to play. Hello. Hello! We need to play Critters. Because of course we do. <laughs> I think the mouse is the most logical starting choice. I wish he always plays cats. Oh, okay, right, as long as I don't lose this one, I'm good. Nice! Smashing this. So long, partner. Oh, but I love her. Do I love her? The other, I don't know. I don't remember their names, but I love them both dearly. Maybe we can have a threesome. Welcome to Sand Rock. I'm Mabel. My husband Cooper and I run the largest yak mole ranch south of the Eufaula. Ever tried yak mole milk before? It's got an acquired taste. <laughs> don't want Here, take a couple of bottles. <laughs> right, I'm not talking to anyone until I clear my inventory out because it's getting ridiculous. I'm going to sell that T-shirt. Back later. <clears throat> the game's taunting me so hard. It's getting a bit late. I'm gonna hang around for a couple more hours. All right, I'm gonna make a chest. I'm gonna see what we got in our little, our little recycler thing. It's still going now, surprisingly. Uh, right. I, s I definitely saw a chest. Somewhere. Mini storage box. There we go. Oh, sweet. Okay. Eh, can I name it? No. It's not big, great, is it? I could do with a bigger one, really. Um, I'm gonna make, I can't make another one. I need more... I need more wood. <clears throat> What do I need for us? Just, are they sticks? No. Wood. From log, recycler, and water will. <laughs> the description, it's wood. I <laughs> think, why, why do you need help with that? What are you even asking me for? Okay, let me see if I can find some wooden scraps or... I'm not allowed to cook down the... Oh, hello. Not allowed to cut down the trees, so we need to hopefully find an alternate way to do this. Just need some wooden scrap. Hello. Sandberry, that's another new one. Yet more things to add onto my... <laughs> Like, I'm trying to get rid of things here. I need less stuff, not more stuff. I just can't resist. I see a thing. And I'm like, I just want to shove my hands in it. Oh, I've got wood from that. Ah, oh, a stone pile. You're my favourite pile. I think I need a little bit more, but... There's another one over here. Wood and everything. Stick your wood anywhere. It <laughs> doesn't matter, apparently. Come on, a little bit, a little bit. Hey, a little bit. Hey, a little bit. No. What about this? Oh, I can't cut it down, though. I think when we get access to that dead wood, life will be easier. But that's looking pretty... Oh, you cheap old player. <laughs> I need a better tool. <laughs> a problem we've all dealt with in our lives. Is that new as well? Sure is. Hmm. Um... 
Okay, that was weird. I think when you come back the next day, the scrap tends to uh, respawn. I don't think I've got enough though, do I? Let me have a little look here. Ah, I just need four pieces of wood. Oh well, what did we get here? Ah! <laughs> Life is pain. Okay, right, 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 right. Let's get rid of some stuff. What do I... I'm just going to put everything that doesn't immediately seem useful. This is my food box, I suppose. Anything slightly food related. <clears throat> and then everything else. I'm going to put the pot down in the house. It's really annoying that this takes up space. I mean, it's fine. Whatever. <laughs> but it's very annoying at the same time. Um, I'm going to keep all that. I'm going to keep that. I'm going to keep that. Power stones. I need those, yeah, I don't think. Okay, we've got two copper bars. I was hoping for more, I'm not gonna lie. Oh, five, wait. Eh? 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 Ah, oh yeah, look at that, what an absolute beast! Okay, so we need... <clears throat> Eight bricks. I think I can... Wait, how do I make bricks? Over here, right? I need eight bricks. I can make seven bricks. Because <laughs> of course I can only make seven bricks. We also need to fuel this up a little bit. I guess this is going to be the main fuel source. So I'm going to stick a bunch of that in. Well, that's 12 minutes 30. Yeah, that's all I need. So I need a little bit more of that stuff. Not even much. Like, let's go crack open a couple of rocks. And we should be get enough to make all those bricks we need. Maybe I'll get a little bit of wood. No. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Come on. There we go. Hopefully that's enough. Could be good to me, game. Ah. I think I took everything out by accident. Time remaining 10 minutes. Okay, that's fine. So that's going to wear away. That should be enough to get me to the, uh, get me everything I need. All right. Let's go to bed. Put this pot down. You know, I've got to make my house all fancy like, you know. I don't know if I even can, actually. <laughs> I'm just assuming I can put this down. Uh, there we go. Nice! Sit in the corner. Bam! Beautiful. <clears throat> it's coming together a little bit. Oh, I need to also do... I've got that task, I forgot. Um, ah, I'm making stone troughs for someone. I don't know, some lass at town. I haven't met her yet. Hello, She's gonna... Builder. Oh. Well, nice to see you again. Oh. <laughs> As for the minister's instructions, I have come with a gift. Water, to be more specific, the most precious gift of all. That just terrifies me. In Sandrock, Martel's Oasis is pretty much our only reliable source of natural water. We also get some water from the other city-states, but it's expensive. So we need to be really careful and smart about how we divvy it out. Might I bring your attention to the humble little fence propped up around the oasis? It's the town's friendly way of saying, Don't take water out of the oasis all willy-nilly, or cut down the trees for that matter. If you're short on water in your workshop, might I recommend checking the plants around your workshop for fresh morning dew, or just come on down to the water tower overlooking the oasis. I'm pretty sure builder machines won't run without water in their water tank, so I guess that means we'll be seeing a lot of each other in the future. <laughs> Well, I won't take up any more of your time. See you at the water tower, new pal. Can't force a friendship, Burgess. 
Okay, from Construction Junction. Hey, Builder, welcome to Sandrock. On behalf of my good friend, Mayor Trudy, who couldn't be available to write this letter because she's dead in the desert, I'd like to extend our warmest regards from this neck of the woods. I own Construction Junction. If you're thinking of upgrading, blah, blah, blah. Okay. <clears throat> and Owen. Okay. What are you glowing? Mm hmm? What? Eh? Huh? Oh, okay. What's Sandberry got to do with anything that I'm clicking on here? <laughs> okay, so I've put water in my water. I need to keep the water tank fueled up. That's four out of eight. That's on the way. We need thick rope, bearings, and wooden sticks. I can make a single wooden stick. Oh, I've got two. Okay, so I get two. So I need three more wooden sticks. That's quick maps. <laughs> Some rope, which needs a recipe from the Commerce Guild store. And bearings. How do I make bearings? Go away. How do I make bearings? Don't know. Can't seem to make bearings. Unless we're in there. So it might well be. Uh, we should probably always have this running away, so... Is that not a bearing there? What's that? Are you... Ah! <laughs> That's a bearing. Okay, so that needs 8 minutes 45. <clears throat> so we need a bit more in there. there we go. Okay, so you're running, you're running. So that's my bearings hopefully done. That's my bricks done. We need a bit of wood. I need some thick rope, so we need to go to the commerce store and try to get that. Just need to get rid of some stuff. Oh, hello. We're getting there, folks. We're getting there. Anything I don't want to carry around with me. Gold, probably not. Dregs I use a lot, plant fiber. Uh, mm -hmm. bum, bum, bum. Keeping the scrap. It's like having a nice neat inventory, what can I say? Oh no, I need the thick rope. Do I need the copper bars? No, not yet. I'll do. Away we go! <clears throat> I got this. Got this. <laughs> it's hardly a complex game, but I do think the inventory system is a bit of a disaster. Hugo, we haven't talked. You're that new builder in town. <laughs> or was it someone else? Ah, that's right. There's two of you. Neon and uh, you must be the other one. <laughs> wow, Hugo. Well, I'm glad you're here. Wow. I'm Hugo, the one and only blacksmith in town. If you need to buy construction materials, upgrade parts for your machines, or obtain top-of-the-line weapons, I'm all you got. But I promise the best. Just check this out. This here is like me, iron tough. That's the quality I'm talking about. It's casually giving... Oh, hello! You're very tiny. Hello, Jensen. We've met, but I don't think we've been properly introduced. I'm Jensen, the conductor of the Sand Rock train station. Nice to have you in Sand Rock. Howdy! What a chad. Yeah, what time it is, Jensen? It's time for me to destroy your critters. All right. I'm always leading with the mouse, I've decided. It's part of my theory. Oh! It's a genius move. Oh, I was this smart. Okay. <clears throat> I played the mouse, he plays the elephant. He then plays the cat. Okay, I'm going to play the cat. Oh! <laughs> Oh, he got me. Catch you later. Okay. Wait, what is what is this? You just give me some milk. You just milk me. <laughs> Don't milk me without my permission. Let's go to the saloon while we're here, I suppose. That's Owen's home. It looks like I've got a quest in here. I, I can't help but shake the feeling that my character is underage. She doesn't look 18. I think she's meant to be, you know, young 20s. I think that's very much the idea, but... 
I don't necessarily get that impression, you know what I mean? I mean look at the size of her company. <laughs> hey, you're one of the new builders. Pleasure to make your acquaintance. I'm Owen. I run the Blue Moon Saloon. I'm gonna take a stab in the dark and suggest that Owen will be a very popular romance choice in this game. Are you hungry? I have a couple sample <laughs> dishes. I know you can work up <laughs> quite an appetite uh, after spending a day in the ruins. Drop by any time. I'll be around. Hey there, builder. Did you get my letter? Why don't we have a chat over some food and drinks? It, it won't take too long. Uh -huh. She's I've been meaning to catch up with you since you moved in, <clears throat> but I guess you and me Anne have been busy with all that's been going on of late. <laughs> As a small token of my appreciation, I'd like to offer you some food and drinks on the house. To a newcomer, sand rock can be a bit overwhelming, but lucky for you, this old barkeep has been around for just a hair longer than a pan bat's age. Uh, perhaps I can shed some light on any subjects you're still unfamiliar with. What would you like to know about? Nothing. <laughs> yep. Uh, don't let me talk your ear off. Some things you've just got to experience to understand. Don't worry too much. You'll fit right in. <laughs> hey, I've been doing all this talking, and I haven't had a bite to eat yet. Uh, maybe you should share your tales as well. <sighs> Today was nice. We gotta do this more often. In any case, let me hit you with a couple takeaway dishes for later. <laughs> Builders can't go hungry, you know? Um... <laughs> why does my character look like a zombie? Stop in at the Blue Moon any time you're out of energy and need a picker-upper. Don't know what to order? Get the special of the day. That's right. We've got a discount on something new every day. Uh, <laughs> uh, sorry. I didn't mean to turn this into an ad spot for the saloon. I'm sure you're busy learning the ropes around here. I'd better get back to it, too. I hope to see you again soon. I like you, Owen, but you talk far too much for my liking. <clears throat> I'm assuming, because it mentioned when she woke Oh my god. <laughs> I think I'm just tired. I think that's literally what it's meant to be. My character needs to go to bed early. She's going to get a nice long sleep tonight. I'll make sure. Why do I have a French grit? Oh yeah, that's why. Okay. What I wanted to do is many things. How long have I got left? One day, 12 hours to make eight troughs. We can do that. That's fine. Talk to the Oh, I'll do that later. I'm going to set that as my target because that one's got a time limit. The others don't. And then I'm going to ignore the commissions for a little bit. Um, the other thing I want to do, though, is we need to go to... Pedagogy. What's that? Isn't it the Commerce Guild I need to go to? Are you the Commerce Guild? <clears throat> I had to buy a recipe, right? I'm sure it was at a Commerce Guild. Oh, it tells me how much stone I've got. Oh, that's very helpful. Oh, hey. Oh, this, they, this is actually my problem with the inventory, right? So if I, if I look at this, I don't know what the recipe is, right? Clearly. If I click LB... It shows me, but then I can't see a bloody thing. There needs to be a spot somewhere on the page that just shows the information without me having to click this. Whatever. Uh, what am I here for? Thick rope. I can't see, man! <laughs> it's really annoying. Wait, how much? 100 stone? No, 20 for 5. It's not, it's not as good. That's much, much worse. Okay. Okay, so we can make the stuff we need, the rope. Um, okay. It's suggesting I have a quest there, and there. Commotion on the bridge. Oh, they're available quests. Uh, I'm going to hold off on that just for I want to get this commission done because I'm scared that I won't finish in time otherwise. And then we'll focus on everything else. <clears throat> Hello, buddy. It's Coco. One day we'll be best friends, Coco. You still not bloody done? Okay. So, stone troughs. Need stone. Let's go smash some stones. 
Actually, my inventory is crackerjacked full of nonsense. <laughs> ah, of course, crackerjacked is not the word I really want to use there. But I've kind of committed now, so crackerjacked is the word I'm going to use there. I don't even know what crackerjacked would mean. <gasps> is that my girl? No, that's Mian. Ugh. My rival! She's being all nice about it as well. It reminds me of how Pokemon has changed. Like in the original Pokemon, red or blue, depending on your provocation, was kind of a dick. <laughs> you know, they were your rival. You were competing against them. But I, I think, from my recollection of playing Sword and Shield, um, they were like all wholesome and nice about it. Which just seems pointless. They're not a rival, you know, threaten to kill me and suck my soul through my eyeballs or something. That's what I want from a rival. None of this Nancy fancy stuff. I think Nancy fancy, Nancy fancy, whatever it is, is probably quite a, a bad term actually that people shouldn't use. I regret my decisions. <clears throat> what? What did I just get? I got a knowledge point. Oh. What is that? Bye up. Wait, wait, wait. While playing the game, you will get different kinds of knowledge XP, which will autom- It was there for so long. <laughs> and then it went just as I bloody was able to read it. I think I've got two. So this is my gathering. So there's gathering, workshop, combat, social. You can level up with a little skill tree. I love a skill tree. Okay, experience from mining increased by 10%. Seems like a good idea. Gathering, logging. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to take this one. I can do it again, right? Nice. Okay, that's cool. 10% more gathering XP and 10% more general XP now when we mine. Seems like a good idea. <clears throat> Nearly there, actually. We've got 39 pieces of stone. Just a little bit more to go. Funny jumper! <laughs> ah, funny jumper! But I'm not here to kill you. We could be friends. We could be lovers. That should be enough. Nice. Lovely, lovely, lovely. Hello, beautiful. Sukumul. How are we doing over here? We've got some brick. Yeah, there we go. And I want to see if this is how I made. No, it's not. You're still not done. You're in empty. There we go. Okay, and this oh, is this the last thing we need. I made that amazing of video games. Wait, no, this is something else. No, <laughs> I thought I'd done the whole thing. I'm looking at it on the right. I'm like, oh, I'm finished. Fantastic. No, that's not. That's very much not the case. Come back in a second. We need rope, don't we? I think rope might be the last thing we need, though. I met this person before. Oh, hey. Another tourist. Uh, howdy. I'm afraid I must be on my way. Uh, the new workshop owner? Well, shoot, now why didn't you say so? I'm Elsie. Pleased to meet you. Sorry I didn't recognize you, partner. I thought all builders were born old geezers like Mason. Nice seeing ya. Not sure I like her attitude. Eh. <sighs> Just take my stone. What? Oh, confirm. Okay. Take her easy. <laughs> the, inventory, the UI is the nightmare on this game. It's so not obvious what you're meant to be clicking at any one time. It's really, really bad, honestly. Maybe I just suck. It's, there's a very definite possibility, but I really do think it's pretty abhorrent. That's what I'm looking for. Right. Stick, rope, bearing. Oh, right, we're trying to get bearings from this. Um, sticks. Need to go get some wood. <clears throat> and rope. We just learned how to craft. What do we need for rope? We probably need fibre, right? I need six. I can make... Six. Out of way. Where is it? Wait, haven't I already... Okay, weird. 
Okay. So all we need is bearings and sticks. We've got three sticks. I need two more. Uh, right, let's go try to get some wood salvage. Where's the salvage yard? It's down here, right? Yeah. What are those? What are you? Probably enemies, I think. What's that? What are you? What are all of these things? What? What is what I need? What is what we... Oh, you absolute temptress. <laughs> no! Wait, no. That's okay. Maybe that's the same, actually. I've got to check. How much wood do I need? Oh, I don't want scrap. <laughs> I don't want wood scraps. Not that it's particularly surprising that what I'm getting from the wood scraps is wood scraps. That seems like a fairly obvious thing, but... I can't cut trees down. It's very frustrating. Do I get wood from this? Oh, I do. Not much, though. What about from this? Probably not, right? Okay, we're going to take down the Yak Thorn and hopefully get enough wood to finish off. I think getting another one of those... Uh, the ones that um, let you turn scrap into stuff is probably a pretty high... Can I kill the cactus? Is that allowed? No, that gave me what I want. I know I'm not allowed to kill the other cacti, but that one, right? It's, it seems fine? Question mark? I don't know. <laughs> no one's yelled at me yet. Don't ask for permission, ask for forgiveness, as they say. Okay, I think we've got to be on the verge of having enough. Should have checked, really, in retrospect. Let's go have a little peek. Are you, are you bloody done yet? Yeah, there we go. What do I get? Dregs. I got four bearings. Oh, you absolute stunner. Okay, last thing we need is two wooden sticks. How many I can make? It's two, I think. Already own three, can make two for assembly station item five. That's how it works. Okay, I, I, I'll get that eventually. Oh, baby. And I can pick it up. What a glorious day. <laughs> Alright, we'll go explore that. I'm just going to clear out my inventory a little bit. Um, if you are new to this series, but I mean, we're all new to this series specifically, you know what I mean then prepare to see a lot of inventory management. It's, an, it's To call it an integral part of this game would be an understatement, I think. Mm. How much do I need? I need to make another chest. Ten wood. Oh, okay. Can I mark that as like a quest? No. Anyways, great success. I am MLG Gamer Boy. She says see you later, boy. Wait, what was that? Is that leak? Oh, I've already had those, I remember. He was a gamer boy, she says see you later, boy. I'm pretty sure that's the song. While we're here. Can't really remember what I get from this, so I kind of want to... <sighs> okay, okay, it's fine. Copper scrap, data disks, I'm just popping everything to get some stamina back. These are health items though, which makes them much more annoying. Uh, anything else I can eat? Ah! At your health, what do you do? <clears throat> health. I'm sure that'll be useful, but right now it's a pain in the ass. I'm gonna level up my stamina at some point. Yeah, anyways, here we go. Very excited. Our first big project. <laughs> I look so bad.
He didn't die. Great success. You, those two lifts you made are running like a drain. Looks like Yan finally did something right higher in the two of you. Maybe we don't have to move out of Sand Rock after all. Well, now me and my boys can finally get back into the abandoned ruins and get to work. But we're still way behind on our mining quota. Say, that gives me an idea. You two like diving, don't you? Sure we do. Ruin diving is what builders do best. Well, that and building. I think I got another way we can both help each other out. You want to do some digging? All right, so here's the deal. The abandoned ruins around here are the pride and joy of Ufala Salvage. They hold precious resources and relics from the old world. They're open to anybody who has the same pass you use to access our salvage yard. Pass fees pay for folks like you to rent a jetpack in case you dig yourself in too deep, and a scanner for finding relics easier. Also, sometimes we gotta hire the Civil Corps to go through from time to time to make sure we don't have any, uh, incidents. You builders can use your pick hammers to dig tunnels through the ruins, and also to break up ores and valuables that you can take back to your workshop to make all kinds of cool stuff. Anything's fine as keepers down there, but, uh, I got a little proposition for you. Since the lift's been out of commission for so long, me and my boys are gonna have to break our backs to make up for lost time. If you want to sell me some of the ores you find in the next couple of days, I'd pay you top goals. Just something to consider. Well, you enjoy yourselves. Don't mind anything I wouldn't mind. Woohoo! It's mining time! <laughs> it's mining, it's mobbing time. <laughs> Okay, well, we'll go do that next time because it's getting a little late and my girl needs uh, she needs some sleep, as we've discussed. Go grab a nap. <clears throat> and then there's there's many myriad quests and lots of things going on in the town and all this kind of jazz. For now, it's nap time. And then we'll go mining. I'm assuming this is like in the last game where you used to go digging and you would um, you just kind of hollow out this area, kind of like Minecraft a little bit. Okay, so you need to sleep before midnight, seemingly. Do I look cool again? I mean, not, I still look a little shattered. <laughs> right, anyways, we shall end it there. Thank you very much for joining me, ladies and gentlemen. In the next video, we will go try out the dig site. We'll go talk to the researcher. And get some wood and hopefully make more chests. And hopefully a bigger chest, I don't know. We'll see. Thanks for joining me. Cheers much of as always. Bye-bye.